Hi, I'm Jonathan from PTFS Europe. And what's on my mind today is adding custom pages to your online catalog. Now, some of you may remember that back in uh, the old days of Koa, you used to be able to use Koa as a content management system. This is the 2111 release notes. And uh, in order to set this up, it was uh, quite a performance because you had to get onto your server and copy uh, Perl scripts and uh, uh, and some HTML pages. So it was certainly non-trivial to set up. In 22.11, there was a new feature called Pages. And that's what we're going to have a look at today. So Pages sit under the tools menu. And uh, in 22.11, there's a new link here called Pages. And from here, you can create as many additional pages to your uh, online catalog as you want to. So what we'll do here is just create a new one from scratch. We could say where it displays, whether it's for the uh, OPAC or for the staff uh, or for both. I'm just going to make this for the OPAC. Uh, I'm going to publish it now. I've pre-prepared a little bit of HTML text, and this is going to be a little about page. So we're going to call it about us. Uh, and that's all there is to it. Of course, if we want to, uh, I'm using the text editor, but of course, if we want to, we can use the WYSIWYG HTML editor as well. Uh, if we've got multi uh, languages, installed on the system, then uh, we can translate into multiple languages as well, which is great. But I'm just going to save this page. And when you do that, it uh, is listed as a page under your pages tab here. So uh, the nice thing about it is we can preview the content. Just check that I haven't spelt anything wrong. And we could also look at the page URL, which is important. So if I just click this page URL open, and I'm just going to copy the URL here. And you can see the page is working just as I want it to. So that's great. Um, but I actually wanted to display it somewhere in the OPAC. Now, obviously, potentially in the online catalog, there's, there's lots of places you could display uh, links. You could display them in the footer, the in these navigation elements. Uh, but... There's also a new feature, uh, which is the OPAC More Searches, which actually is great because in previous versions, you had to use JavaScript to add uh, items to the mast header here, to this menu on the mast header. In 22.11, if we just go back to the uh, HTML customizations, you could create a new element, a new location element called OPAC More Searches. And OPAC Mordor Searches is what this element is just here. So if I just edit this, you can see that um, here's my custom page from previously. So what I'm going to do is just um, duplicate that and add a second element there. And this is actually page 68 here. So I'll just get rid of that. And this is going to be called About Us. Save that. And then if we refresh our page here, or if we just go back to the home page, you can see now I have a new element on my masthead here, the link to the About Us page. And if I click that, that should take us out. You'll notice that I set it up as... Um, uh, I set it up as a target uh, to open a new tab. Obviously, you don't have to do that. You can keep it within the within the same tab if you want to, which might be more appropriate in this case or in other cases. Um, but yeah, by combining those two uh, two features, it's great for adding additional content to your online catalog. So uh, I think it's a great replacement for the for that previous way of extending Koa. And um, hopefully it's given you something to go away and look at in 2211. So look forward to seeing you next time. Bye for now.